Hey, good morning. I'm still here, right? <laughs> I'm talking. It's about energy. I do the return of senders. I did more than I did the first time. That's just sending the energy back. And it's like, you have to pay attention. Pay attention to the energy people carry because people are, people are weird. And a lot of people play in magic. It could be your family, it could be someone that you're close to. You know, you cut off ties and they wanna get back in your energy. They wanna hang out, they wanna, you know? And it's like, yo, like I know you wanna do something and these people are stuck with bad luck and karma you know you have good luck <laughs> you have good luck you have good karma and then these people want to stick you with their bad luck and their karma don't hang out with them don't hang out with them they're gonna try and be like oh we could do this or we could do that and we can hang nah <laughs> i'm like i don't want to hang out with you you know they'll do anything to get back into your space because it's like you know i i i try i try <laughs> to deal with people and you know and it could be it could even be family and then it just gets to the point where like everybody's just so fucked up they on this they on this energy they on this demon time and it's like i know you on i know you on one and i'm like i'm just not I'm not gonna jeopardize my life, my future, my children, and be fucked up because somebody doesn't, you know, because somebody else is fucked up and then they don't want their karma. They don't wanna deal with the shit that they did. They don't wanna deal with their mistakes and their errors and now they have all this bad luck and all this karma. So they just want to be in your energy, like to stick you with their bad luck. And I don't even know how they do this shit. Cause it's like I stay away. I stay away from everybody. I don't want nobody around me with their shit. Like the only way I'm around is if you're your good energy. Like your energy has to be on a on a on a high level. Like I don't I think my sister, my brother, I won't even open my door because the energy is just like yo i'm not gonna stay stuck with your kids and they're not gonna be driving me crazy in my house and then my you know they just want you to be fucked up because they're fucked up and i'm like yo i'm not gonna be fucked up <laughs> like i'm not gonna be fucked up i leave so fast and then it's just all different kinds of people do it and then it's just it's not awkward when the family does it, but then it's like, you you already know how people do you. You know, they want to tr talk and they want to act all buddy-buddy, but you know they was doing shit to you before. Like, they was doing stuff. And then you're okay, you overcame it. You had to grow, you had to heal, you had to evolve. And you're okay, right? They're fucked up now. And now they want to be in your energy and in your space. And they want you to be fucked up because they're all fucked up. And it's like, don't receive them. Don't receive them. Don't let them in, they, in your house. Don't hang out with them. Like, don't even bother. <laughs> like, don't bother because you don't have to be their friend. You don't have to keep a communication with them, even if it is your family. Because family, family is people that are there that'll support you, that'll build you up. If family does not build you up, they just cause you more stress and more burdens and they don't do anything good for you, then that's not family. That's just, you just have to deal with it until you grew up and you could take care of yourself and now you can take care of yourself. You don't have to deal with these people. <laughs> you don't have to deal with them. Like your family is your children, the, the people that you made. Like you made a child, then, then that's your responsibility. You know, the child is your responsibility until whatever happens. When they have a baby, then you'll be a grandma, a grandpa. You know, that's who you deal with. But everyone else doesn't matter. They don't matter. Your, they don't matter. Your aunts, your uncles, your sisters, your brothers, they don't matter. Like if they sit there and they're trying to have you all fucked up because they're all fucked up, you don't have to be around them. <laughs> you don't have to be around them. Like you don't have to accept 
their toxicity or their fucked up life you don't have to feel bad because they're going through a difficult time like you're going through that shit because of the things that you're going through that's not my problem like i what you want me to do like you know uh, i'm on my business and i just stay away i stay away for my own safety i stay away because i don't want to get mad i don't want to talk shit i don't want to you know i just i avoid it at all costs because it's like yo you really trying to sit here and play with me like i know what you're doing and then they will lie they'll lie and then because you're reacting or you're calling them out on they shit then they're gonna say you're crazy like you know what I don't have time <laughs> like, I don't have time for this shit like I don't want to play with you like no I don't want to no I'm not playing this game like just stay away stay away from me you know but it's like once you know what's going on then they're gonna act like you're crazy or something's wrong with you and then they're really out there playing in black magic they're manipulating situations they're forcing situations or they're trying to burden you or they're trying to do something with your energy or they're trying to switch the energies and it's like you know what when it's like that and you call them all out on it then they want to sit there and play like they don't they didn't do anything and you know that they doing something but i didn't do anything oh my god how can you say that at the bitch like oh my god it's like i can't i try but i just can't deal with the with the shit <sighs> whatever i just had to let that out because you know and it's like no one helped me with anything no one supported me no one was there for me and then now they want me to be there for them and it's like no i'm not gonna be there the, like nobody was there when i I needed somebody to talk to nobody I had to figure everything out by myself and now now they want to call they want to pop up and they want to call and they want to and then once I block them then they want to start talking to the kids I'm like oh hell no I gotta go unblock them and tell, don't talk to my kids like don't be messaging my kids don't you don't do it then, I, then, then I'm, I'm crazy or I'm mean or oh I'm serious like whatever don't talk to my kids because if anything you know i lose my whatever i'm trying so hard to stay calm and not be angry and upset but now the phone calls are coming now they want to start popping up like don't pop up over here because i don't i don't open the door and the calls i don't answer the phone so then they text like 20 texts i'm like what the fuck is this I have to block them block them then they start calling the kids and it's just like oh and then they try to manipulate them because the kids don't know what's going on so it's just it's always mess it's always drama it's always lies and then the whole thing is is how can you prove it because they're they're gonna lie <laughs> they're gonna lie and you can't prove it all the things that they put you through you just gotta overcome it and you can't prove what they're doing you just gotta just overcome the shit and be like i'm not dealing with this person or i don't want this person in my life ever again but there's no way you can prove it so and then when you come to the person toe to toe face to face and you say something or you'll mention it they are gonna deny it you start acting your kind of way and then oh you're serious or oh you're crazy and oh this and oh that but they actually did do all this black magic against you it's backfiring they're going through karma and now they want to get back and they want to be your friend again and they want and it's like i'm just i'm not playing this game with these people it's like yo like <sighs> Pay attention just pay attention pay attention because if it's happening to me then it's happening to other people too like you cut them off and then they want to come back and it's like yo I'm not no no I'm not doing this with you guys it's family it's friends it's whoever it's like uh-uh 
No. No, no, and no. Pay attention. Pay attention. When you cut someone off, don't go backwards. Don't go back to the same hot mess. Because it's always going to be the same hot mess and it's going to be worse. It's going to be worse than it ever was before. So you never go backwards. If you leave a situation, leave. Thank God you love. Thank God you got out of there. Thank God you it's not a part of your life. And don't welcome it back into your life because that's like you're just cursing yourself. Like you don't even care about your future. It's like you're gonna just let it happen again and be like, oh, but it's my family. Oh, is this? Oh, I've known them for such a long time. Like, oh hell no. <laughs> like get out of there. Get out of the situation. If it's not good for you, get out of there. Don't stay. You don't have to stay where you're not wanted, you're not loved, you're not appreciated, you're not welcomed. And then you leave them and then now they want you back because you have good energy. Don't go back. <laughs> Be like, yo, I'm out. I've been loved. Like, I'm not coming back. I'm not coming back. <laughs> and leave it like that. Keep it like that. Stay positive, vibe high, focus on yourself, make yourself better. And you don't have to worry about everyone else, everyone else that's going through their shit or they're going through a difficult time. They wouldn't be going through a difficult time if they were not doing evil, wicked, malicious things. That's the reality of that. And you are not responsible for picking up other people's karma you don't have to help them you don't have to be there for them you don't have to listen to them like that's not your problem when you wanted to be there they didn't appreciate you so you're gone stay gone <laughs> stay gone be out and be happy that you got away from the shit. that's all i could say to that like be happy you got away from it and don't go backwards don't go backwards <laughs> always leave with love bye